Welcome back to Staxel, everybody. Welcome back to the village of Miney Do, where I'm just having a little nap. Okay, like it's morning. I've just woken up, and uh, it's time. It's time to get out of bed, go and get go and get some stuff. Hey, Lily, there's a spider web in our corner, in the corner of our house, Lily. Let's get rid of this shit. Now, at some point, we're gonna have to fix this house. Okay, like we've got to get some new windows in. Like, get rid of these stupid crates and get some furniture down. Hey, Lily. Um, you know, stuff like that. Oh, they need some food. We better better make sure. Oh, let's go and get, check our crops. I reckon the crops might be done. Um, okay, but, yeah, I, I, as I was wandering around, I did I did end up picking up some stuff. Um, yeah, look, it turns out we, we got some more leaves and things. Um, I've got this empty crate, which I do want to put down somewhere and fill with stuff. But I'm not quite sure what I want to fill it with. Maybe not poo. I'm not sure poo is a good idea. But, uh, hey, Lily, go and, go and get yourself some food. Yeah, we need to replace these windows. Um, I need to fix this wall, you know, put up some lighting, uh, get this stuff plumbed in, you know? I mean, I, I don't know, I don't know if any of it's func- Okay, yeah, no, no, the toilet's functional, so that's good, but I guess the sink isn't. Like, I don't know if that's because it's not, um, plumbed in, or like, maybe, maybe there's just no functionality, you know? But there's floor tiles we've got to replace, you know, I mean, look, look at, I mean, look how many f missing floor tiles are, it's ridiculous. Like, Oh, I don't know. First things first, anyway. We should probably get our crops watered, you know? And, like, thankfully, it's not really a chore. Because this game is wonderful, and it lets you it lets you water your crops nice and quickly. You know, you just stroll across them like this. Um, of course, it, it helps if... really helps if you don't mess up your lines like that. But uh, there we go. We, we fixed that one now. So that's good. Um, but, yeah, we'll, we'll pick up this poo. Uh, Mildred, Bertha, good morning to you two. It looks like, uh, looks like these two are happy, which is nice. Uh, Scrambles, where are you? Scrambles. Scramble. Oh, what's this? I'm going to catch this. This is the film. Like, it's, it's like you've got, everyone who plays it's got ADD. So you wander around, it's like, oh yeah, got to feed the chickens. And oh, bug. And oh yeah, I'll chop down this tree. And then like, I'll, you know, it's just like, there's so much stuff to do. You, you've got to kind of, kind of keep on top of it all. Scrambles, what are you doing over here? Uh, Scrambles. If you're hungry, like, why don't you go and get some food? Like, what's going on? Um, hmm. Maybe we'll go and find some way to, to pick up scrambles, because I'm a little bit, little bit worried about that, I'll be honest. Um, but yeah, we should probably just head straight over to the village shop. Uh, we, we can, we, we, what, what the hell are you doing up there? Like, get down. You're going to hurt yourself. Um, I, like, I don't, I can't deal with villagers hurting themselves, honestly. I don't want anyone dying. Uh, ooh, acorn. Okay, uh, now we're gonna head into the hardware shop because it's the place to get, you know, all of the all of the sheet metal that we need. I don't know where I don't know where they get the sheet metal. There isn't like a you know like a, a forge or anything. They must import it. Maybe from like there it is. Maybe from like Japan or something like that. I don't know. So, somewhere. I I think we only need one piece of sheet metal, which is good. I guess we can check. Um, so have a little look. To Rhino, yeah, it looks like we only need one piece of sheet metal, which is good. So I'm, I'm not going to waste my money on any any more than that. What I might go and do, though, see if there's some way we can pick up scrambles, okay? Because I, I don't want him starving to death under that tree. Like, that is that is not it's not a good look for the farm, okay? If our animals are, are starving to death, especially not when there's food in their, in their containers. Now, is there some way... Chicken sign. Is there some way we can... Oh, capture crate. Okay, how does this work? Let's have a little look, shall we? Capture crate. Use this to capture farm animals. Okay, this this sounds like exactly what we want, okay? We're just going to ignore the butterflies and stuff we've got for now. Let's go and capture ourselves a scramble, shall we? Hey, Leaf. Hey, Melissa. Um, because I, again, like, I don't want him starving to death. He's, he is the mascot of our farm, okay? He's like the most important animal we've got. If anything, we, we might have to fence him in, all right? I didn't want to. I wanted him to be able to, like, wander around the farm free and easy. You know, enjoying enjoying the the kind of open range that uh, that 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 we have, but it turns out like he's a little bit stupid, and uh, despite the fact he's got food in his box, he he's just starving to death somewhere out here under a tree. Here he is. Scrambles, what are you doing? How how do I? There we go. So scramble in a crate. Nice. I've got a scramble in a crate. That's kind of cool. I like it. I like it. Why why does this look like it's not watered now? No. It, it definitely is. Okay, fine. Um, all right, scrambles. Eat your food. Seriously, eat your food. 
It's right there, okay? There's no reason for you to be going hungry. I've even got more, okay, Scrambles? Look, I've got more food for you. Eat your food. Are you happy now? Right, it's happy now. Okay. Jesus, that was that was a bit hit and miss there, wasn't it? I was worried about old scrambles. I didn't want didn't want to lose old scrambles. You know, we'd have to get another scrambles, and uh, that's that's quite a lot of money. I'm gonna have to capture a lot of grasshoppers and crickets and stuff if uh, we, you know, we wanted to get another scrambles. This is this isn't the worst. Oh god, I forgot about these crops. Oh man, I I am literally literally the worst farmer. Um. Okay. Well, I guess it's not looking healthy. It needs water. It's not looking healthy. All right. I, I do apologize. Like, I bet people were screaming at me about that. Like, I, I'm such an idiot, honestly. Like, I didn't mean to do that. I, um, I, I truly, truly didn't. Can I, will that turn back into grass now? I think it will turn back into grass now. Shit. I need to give myself, like, a big sign that says, don't forget these plants, don't I? Maybe I'll go and see if there's, like, a plant sign that we can buy. You know, I mean, we've only got a sheep sign down here. Now, we need our rhino beetles. Okay, so we're going to pick those up. Uh, and... We need to get our... Where is it? Uh, our sheet metal. and Put it in our hands. Okay, we'll get the rhino beetles as well. Okay, so if we put the... Not the rhino beetles. I don't think rhino beetles will enjoy being carved. I'll be honest. I mean, I'm not... I'm not particularly looking forward to using them anyway. I, mean, I guess we're using them as bait. But, you know, it's, it's a little bit mean, isn't it? Oh, here we go. Look at this. Bait box. Perfect. Craft that son of a... Bitch. Is it... Is it crafted? There we go. Okay, fine. That that worried me for a second there. Nice. Okay, well, let's let's pick up our nails and lumber as well, just in case we need them again. All right? I'm enjoying our new carving station. It's got to be said. So we've got a bait box now, which is good. Uh, and we need to combine the bait box. Oh, it's a simple box. Oh, can we use this for anything? Can we put it down? Oh, you can. Oh, that's cool. Can you, can you just put stuff in it? Oh, it doesn't look like we can put stuff in it. Okay. So it's just a simple box right now. It is literally just a box. You can't put anything in it. It's just for decoration, you know. Nothing nothing particularly fancy. Now we need to go and get the old, uh... Rhea, don't worry about it. I'm, I'm on it. I'm on it, baby. Don't you worry about it. Cecile? Don't look at me like that. Uh, okay. Let, I, I, I need to go and combine these. So I think we need to head back to the back to the hardware workshop. Jesus Christ. This is... It's a lot of running back and forth between this shop. I need to get some of these myself. Okay. Uh, combine? Assemble? Oh god, do I need something else to combine these, or is this just a... It's just... Is, is combining just something I can do? Oh, combining station... Ugh. Okay. It looks like we need more money, alright? Before we can finish this bait box, we need more money. Yet more money, okay? Now, I guess... We could look at investing some- oh god, I just spent all that money on a capture crate as well. We could look at investing some money into, like, apiaries and things. I mean, I- I- I know there was- There's a $700 chicken coop, Jesus Christ. I know there's- there's, like, beehives somewhere here, isn't there? Um, That's- that's a chicken coop again. I guess- I guess we're in a different section? Apiaries, where are you? Well, I, I'm sure Lisa will help us out. Lisa, tell me, tell me what I do with the apiary. Uh, oh, wait, it's, no, no, they're not here. Tell me where I find the apiaries, Lisa, please, please give give me that information. I really, I really could use that information right now. Um, okay, well, I can't, I can't hear her. So unfortunately, we're, we're oh, there it is, apiary. Okay, cool. Um, all right, seven hundred dollars is not not the worst. All right, I'd be, I'd be very interested to find out how the apiary works as well. Actually, I nearly sold my rhino beetles then. Oh, that would have been that would have been a, a head a face palming moment if I if I'd ever seen one. Look how big this leaf is. One. Fine, whatever. No, actually, I I do want to sell it. Screw it, let's sell it. Uh, this butterfly, forty eight. I I do like the fact that we can make so much money by like harvesting everything in the environment. You know, like I, d I don't know who's buying this stuff. Maybe like butterfly collectors. Maybe they're like buying all of these insects and things that we're we're capturing. But like I. I mean, it can't be good, right? I mean, maybe maybe it's okay. Maybe there's like hundreds of insects and maybe I'm the only person harvesting them. Alternatively, like maybe everybody is doing this to try and make some money. And, um... Why, why, why? Oh, I thought I put a cr her cricket on my hotbar. I didn't, I didn't. Maybe everybody is doing this to make some money. And like the, the environment is, is slowly dying and I just don't realize it. Like that—that that would be—that would be pretty bad. 
I'll be honest with you. Should we try selling some grass? What do you reckon? Uh, place? 21. Meh. It's coinage. It's coinage. And I've got, I've got so much of this crap in my inventory, I just want to get rid of it, to be honest with you. Like, six coins is worth better than zero coins, right? And, like, this stuff, easily replaceable. Although, probably not. Like, do you think selling the dirt in the world is a bad idea? Because, like, it's not replaceable, is it? It's, it's, now that's gone. Like, my world is now that many box smaller. Hmm. Maybe that wasn't the best idea. I don't know. Should we see how much these pickets I accidentally made sell for? Uh, 80. Cool. I'll take those. That seems pretty good to me. Now we're just left with some building supplies. So I guess, um, I wonder how much raw stone sells for. No, not, not that much, it turns out. Okay. I guess what we could do is, like, we could set this raw wood, um, you know, being sawed. And then, uh, being sword. And then we could, we could go and look out for, uh, you know, some bees and stuff for the apiary when we get around to buying that. Uh, we can go and find ourselves some insects and maybe, um, I don't know, maybe, maybe some kind of rare plants or something that we can, you know, uh, pick up and, and, and turn into cash monies. Um, I don't know if that will work, but we'll see. Right, craft, go. Okay, we're going to leave that raw wood crafting for now, because we don't, I don't think we need raw wood. I'm, I'm sure some recipes will probably require raw wood at some point. But, like, right now, I never I never tend to see them. But what we'll do is we'll... we'll oh, look, snail. You're worth money. Uh, we will, you know, we'll take that raw wood. We'll turn it into fine number, I think. And then we'll probably try and sell that. See if that's see if that's worth any money. I mean, that's that's free money, right? We don't have to be there, you know, doing anything to actually sell it. And uh, it was it was just excess, because we've still got a big pile of lumber in our inventory. So, like, I, I, I don't see anything wrong with doing it. Oh, Rhino Beetle! Oh, maybe we can sell one and see how much it's worth. That, that would be an interesting experiment, actually. Now we've got an extra one. I think that's probably a good idea. Like, I I don't know if you can turn raw stone into anything either. Like, maybe stone blocks or something are worth more money than raw stone. Um, I can hear... I can hear crickets. There we go. Look at that. That was my hearing. I, I use my ear holes uh, to listen to the sound of, of the cricket and, like, located it. Despite the fact that I'm only using uh, a mono headset, I just want to point out, like, I don't have any, like, omnidirectional hearing going on right now. Uh, and it's because I like to have one ear, one ear open, one ear with game audio, you know, because I, I need to be able to hear the world around me, especially with a little one. Like, I need to be able to hear if he, he needs my attention or anything like that. And uh, if, I, if I've got big headphones on, can't do that shit, okay? It doesn't, doesn't work. Should we go and do a bit of beachcombing? Lisa did tell me in the old, uh, in the old comment section that beachcombing is a way to make money. And I guess it's because there's, there's like, a lot of stuff on the beach. And I, I hopefully this stuff will um, respawn as well, you know, because it comes from the ocean. Like, when, when the tide comes in, uh, all of these starfish and these seashells and stuff, they, they should be washed in. And you know what? I'm not too worried about, you know, over-farming over these because, uh, honestly, there's it's a big old ocean, Okay. And like, there's probably like thousands of starfish and snails all over the uh, all over the ocean. What's this? Oh, it's a swirly snail. Cool. Okay. Well, that's new. Uh, I don't know if we can fish in the ocean. Like, we never we never did find out. Seeing as I, I I decided to move the fishing platform. I mean, it was a stupid idea to build it out here. You know, how far away is this? Can you imagine having to run this far every time we wanted to come and do a little bit of fishing, try and make some money that way? It it would have been it would have been hell. I'm glad I'm I'm glad I decided not to do that. Honestly. Like, I, it was a pretty sensible idea. It did seem, I mean, it did seem like the pond at the time was too small. And, like, fishing in a pond, that that seems like an easy way to, like, overfish and, uh, you know, kill off all of the all of the natural kind of things in the environment. But at the same time, like, maybe maybe the mayor is just, like, artificially populating the ponds with fish for me, uh, for, for me and Rhea to catch. Um, I'll be interested as well to see if any of the other villagers do any fishing. Or if it is literally just going to be Bria sat there all day and all night, like uh, I kind of, I kind of get the impression that's the point, right? It's like it's like creating a, a location that you can expect to find her, so that it's it's easy, you know, to to do so. <laughs> <laughs>